Webpack is, I would say for a very long period, it was the de facto standard bundler for the web. Almost everyone was using it. All the major frameworks were built on top of it. And I think the reason for its popularity is because it is so flexible. It is extremely powerful. You can pretty much customize every part of it. It is designed to be as flexible as possible. And I think it was also a necessary design because in the early days of web development, there are so many differing opinions on how we should do things. People just disagreed on almost everything. So Webpack, as a tool, it wanted to support all these different use cases and opinions. So it made itself extremely flexible. And people started writing plugins and loaders on top of Webpack to essentially customize it uh, to fit their use cases or preferences. Almost every framework had their own version of CLI. So Vue had Vue CLI. React had Create to React app, and there are meta frameworks built on top of Webpack as well. All of them do very deep customization. 